Okay, so Wolves won. Crystal Palace nil, FA Cup third round. Um, through to the next round, job job done, really. Um, fairly impressed with the team selection. Thought we kept it really strong. Good to see Den Duncan back in there. Makes such a difference, obviously. Uh, one or two of the sort of more fringe players got a game as well. Um, fairly stress-free night, really, from a Wolves fan's point of view. Not really too much to write home about. I don't think they'll make a massive highlights package of the game overall, but really comfortable first half. What a goal by Traore. Um, he looked good. He looked like maybe at his best 45 minutes for Wolves uh, this season, the first half. Good evening. Well, we're in the next round of the Cup, hey, guys? Um, pretty good feeling, even though we can't be there to, to watch it. Um, they didn't have a shot on our goal tonight. Uh, Ruddy could have gone on holiday, anywhere he fancies. It wouldn't have made any difference, uh, not really. Um, and um, to be fair, Wolves were solid at the back. They were they were pretty much in control in midfield. Troyore was lively and scored a cracking goal. Um, we missed a couple of others, uh, which we probably should have put in. Um, I don't like to to look like I'm berating the kid, but Silva should have had one in the first half, in my opinion, again. Second half, as you'd expect, they obviously came on to us a little bit more, trying to search for the equaliser. Palace weren't really up for it, I don't think. I think I'd be really disappointed if I was a Palace fan tonight. But I um, thought Neves did well. Um, Neto was good, especially in the first half. And it was, um, yeah, really comfortable, actually. Quite an enjoyable watch, that. Um, great also to see Catroni and Gibbs-White come on. Not really much of a test for either of them tonight. I think they got sort of about 10 in 25 minutes, respectively. Few touches of the ball look like they might be might be all right. The real test for those two guys will be in the coming weeks, no doubt, in the league games. But the the objective tonight was to get through unscathed, and that's exactly what we've done with the first team in the hat. I think for the fourth round, and it'd be nice. It'd be nice to have a decent cup run. Um, I think we need to invest in the transfer market in another striker because bringing Catrone back, whether that works or not, one injury to either Silva or Catrone, we're back where we started. So we certainly need to address the balance there. Um, but also, I, I, I do believe uh, everything else he did in the game was pretty good, uh, Fabio Silva, um, apart from put the ball in the net, uh, which is what we really need him to be doing. It's great having someone to invest in the future, but we also need someone to be doing it now. Is Catrona the answer? Well, I don't think anyone expected it to be a classic. 1-0 uh, is the third time we've played Palace now. In the sort of no fan lockdown scenario, bit more three times, uh, and not even letting a goal. So we look we look strong against those sort of teams. Uh, just hopefully now bring that into the games on Tuesday, and the big one next weekend. But uh, in Nuno we trust. Then on we go up the walls. Patrick Catrone, he loves the pizza, he loves the pasta, the lads. Well, we'll see, won't we?